Hello everyone, it's me ASMR if welcoming you to my new logo design tutorial and today I'll show you this type of simple logo but uh, in a easiest way and that is the creative logo. I'll show you how to make this one. So let's start the tutorial. If you are new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. Going to the file at first, going to the new options, we'll take an artboard which is uh, 2000 pixel and 2000 pixels and uh, you can take the RGB color mode for the web purpose and CMYK for the print purpose and after that hit the create button and then going to the line segment tool taking the line by pressing shift and hold it before start the whole tutorial I'll show you uh, here I'm using the essential classic for the work uh, place and make it your own as a like me as like me and then going to the view options uh, except these two things uncheck all the stuffs that means this smart guide will tick mark and the snap to point is tick mark and uh, in a basic portion i'll show you and uh, suppose i have a shape i will copy this one by using the press um, the option button and uh, if you press the option or alter button you can make another copy of this one and press the shift and hold it you can make those things by easily copy by that or you can shape uh, or paste this one by pressing alter option button and press ctrl or command d for the repetition so we'll use this basic in this tutorial and here line segment tool taking this one press alter option button by pressing and hold it you're making copy by this uh, at first when you are taking the line segment tool you have to make the stroke color over here and press the alter option button you'll get the copy like this and copy another one which is a little bit closer and select all the stops and alter option button and make copy another one press ctrl or command d it will be press the alter option button and shift intercept this one press ctrl or command d it will make copy by pressing here and making it group ctrl c and ctrl f copy and forward paste and making this one into like that making group making into middle of this and press the shift and hold it and making it like that select all the stuffs and after that here is a shape builders tool shape builders tool helping us to make the shape over here turning off the stroke taking fill color prominent fill color i should take it will help you out to recognize easily here uh, our logo was here is g here is i and l so at first we'll take a g logo over here g and here is i and here is l so already we got our desired logo and now we'll delete the lines at a time here is a quick selection tool or magic one tool select once the line will select and delete all the stuffs selecting this logo turning off the stroke from here and placing it to middle of this and going to the text tool making the text size bigger and writing down the title gaming lover and choose a font uh, which i downloaded from the dafont.com and i'll provide you the download link in my description making it a little bit smaller according to these age and these age okay that's good can making it a little bit okay making it bigger and it will be closer upper side that's good and making it group now taking an artboard behind this logo okay the artboard color will be darker blue double press in this portion and taking the darker blue portion yeah that's good and the title will be into the white color or we'll use this color earlier okay this one right press and ungroup this one will provide gradient over here and going to the this gradient option here you will find out this gradient if you scroll it out okay here we'll take this one and here is small plus sign we'll take this one and here we'll get this blue and this blue so here this blue will work with this going to the hsl 
or CMYK or HSB actually it will help you out to making it a little bit darker yeah that's fine now press G from the keyboard the gradient slider or gradient adjustment will appear and making it like this so our logo is ready so I want to change the color so I want to change this one into a little bit reddish type yeah that's good G from the keyboard you can make it more like this or like this that's nice our main logo is ready you can uh, make any kind of mock-up or other things how to make the mock-up going to the website and going to the free peak or other free websites uh, and write down logo and here is the PSD filtering and uh, free it will help you out to get the free three or four things will be free for you and choose your one which is uh, really cool you have to find it out so after downloading that going to the show in folder double press and unzip that this one PSD file open within a Photoshop after that here place your logo and we'll take the logo from here our AI and taking this to control command C copy and control command V for the paste and making it a little bit smaller and saving it out it will save in this window taking time okay here is some sample text you have to turning off okay this one we got these easily so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on the video comment section until the next video i may say i'm signing out stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers bye bye